We all know that Beretta makes pistols, shotguns, rifles, you name it, we make it. But shotguns are the ones that are probably more steeply rooted in our history. And semi-automatic shotguns are what made us famous all over the world. Today, Beretta offers three platforms, the A300, the A350, and the A400. All semi-automatic shotguns, but all with different features. And one of the questions I get very often is, what's the difference between one, the other, and the other? Why should I choose an A300 versus an A400, for example? Mm -hmm. Wes O'Connor joins us. He's one of the reps at Beretta, so he's handling and talking about the shotguns every day of the week. And I thought he'd be the best person to walk us through each one of these lines. Tell us more about it. Absolutely. I'll first start with the A300. What's neat about this gun is it's actually made right here in the U.S. of A. Um, the A300 is a 3-inch chambered, 12-gauge, 20-inch uh, barrel length, and it comes in three different options. It comes in syn synthetic, wood, and also camo. Uh, what's nice about this gun is you can do pretty much anything with it. If you want to take it out, turkey hunting, waterfowl, even the sporting clays range, you can do it at a very affordable price. Next up is the A350 beautiful uh, camo pattern, but what's unique about the A350 versus, for example, the A300? Yeah, this gun has really taken off for us. What's nice about this gun is it has adjustable spacers, so you can adjust your length of pull to fit any type of shooter. Uh, what's also really cool about this is we actually have the rotating bolt design, which we do have in our A400 Extreme. Um, this gun is available in Realtree Max 5, a 12 gauge, 28 inch option, um, and it is a great step up with three and a half inch capabilities above the A300 Outlander. Versus the three inch capability of the A300. Correct, exactly. W what's next? The next one is the A400? The next one is our top tier, which is our A400 Extreme. Let's take a look at one. So this is the top of the line A400 Extreme. Yes, it is. A step up further from the A350 and two steps up from the A300. Yep. What's going on with this gun? Uh, I love this gun. Uh, you'll probably notice one unique thing is the kickoff. We've actually taken our old kickoff on the Extrema from back in the day and we've incorporated it in the middle of the stock. Uh, this helps eliminate about 70% of the overall recoil. Um, it also is available with adjustable spacers so a shooter can customize to a length of pull. It does have our blink operating system. Um, what's neat about this gun, um, it also has a B-lock system. So this is a 60 degree turn and you can disassemble your gun uh, very easily. Available in multiple options, uh, Realtree Max 5, black synthetic, and multiple barrel lengths, 26 inch, 28 inch, and also 30 inch. So this is an all-around gun that you can take in the waterfowl field, uh, turkey hunting, sporting clays, you can pretty much do anything with it. And this has three and a half inch capabilities, and also you can cycle two and three quarters all the way up to three and a half inch. So the whole gamut. The whole, the whole gamut. This is, this is the best of the best. <laughs> so A300, A350, A400, there's a shotgun for pretty much everybody. Where can people find more? You can go on Beretta.com, find your local dealer, and go check it out. Go check it out. So you heard it. If you have a question about the A300, the A350, or the A400, what's the difference between all of them? You got the answer right here from the babe's mouth of Wes O'Connor. <laughs> from Las Vegas, it's all. We'll see you guys soon.